All lanes of I-77 in Broadview Heights are back open. The road was closed for hours today after a morning crash that killed two people. Bob Jones is live on 5 in Broadview Heights right now. Bob, what an awful scene there this morning. It was a terrible scene, Lee, and within the last couple of hours, ODOT has reopened the entrance ramp from State Route 82 to I-77 North, but it was a standstill for much of the day for the drivers as both sides of I-77 were shut down for several hours. Earlier today, the Broadview Heights Fire Chief told us that a piano moving truck traveling southbound on 77 went through a guardrail and slammed into a northbound car, crushing it and killing 57-year-old Gail Bradley of Medina. The truck driver, 33-year-old David Starr of Barberton, also died. Three other cars were involved in the chain reaction crash, injuring four others. While rescue crews helped the victims and police cleaned up the scene for hours, traffic became a bottleneck. On Route 21, it took 45 minutes to an hour for drivers to go just a few miles. A gas station employee talked to drivers and saw a picture from the accident scene. The picture that I saw was on somebody's phone. I mean, it, it looked like somebody took a uh, like a knife and just chopped the top of the car off and then smashed it down. It was not looking good. We're told other victims who were injured in this terrible crash on I-77 this morning were taken to Metro Health Medical Center. We are not aware of their conditions tonight and police are still trying to figure out how and why this all happened this morning.